Okay, so next up we're gonna meet Poppy at the uh, Irondale, at, at the cave, whatever the hell the place we're supposed to be meeting her at. World of Mappa. Oh, oh, surprisingly, we're not all the way in the back. I hate the luring times on this. There's really no way to make them faster, especially with my settings. Nice to see you, my young friend. <gasps> oh, how I love a good puzzle. Excuse me, madam. I thought I heard you say something. Yes, indeed. Talking to myself again. I find myself to be quite the engaging conversationalist since my husband passed. Madam Althea Twiddle, pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Madam Twiddle. You know, you might be interested in this. You young people love this sort of thing. My husband often ruminated on the mysterious statue just outside our hamlet. Some sort of archaic puzzle involving vases, he would insist. I stumbled upon it today when I had a burst of energy and extended my morning constitutional a bit longer than usual. An archaic puzzle? Sounds fascinating. You see, I suspected you'd be interested and wait till I tell you about the rumours surrounding this particular puzzle. My husband Greville insisted that solving the puzzle would reveal a magical challenge of sorts. The man was intrigued by everything. He was about to try and solve it himself when... <sighs> Perhaps you could take a look. I'd be rather interested to hear what, if anything, you find. If I happen to see it, I'll have a look. Ah, the spirit of youth. I do hope you'll be able to... Yeah, whatever. I'm not here for that. I'm here for... What's way out there? I should look into the statue, madam. Why are you trying to find that damn statue right now? I'm gonna deal with some centaurs. If I'm safe to explore in there. You made it. I take it this means you had some luck at the library. It took a few hours and some eye watering maps, but I think this might be the cave Doran told us about. Impressive, especially with how little information he gave us. Well, I'm still not sure this is the cave, but it did seem the most promising. 
I stumbled across some folklore about a cave in the area that people avoid. Seemed the perfect place to hide something of value. It's a bit of a leap, I confess, but might a mysterious item such as a special moonstone be hidden in an equally mysterious cave? I think I'm desperate for anything at this point. Well, we're here. We might as well have a look. Agreed. I wonder if you'd go blind from staring directly at a moonstone. Well, into the cave we go. You don't think the rumors about the cave are true, do you? I suppose we'll find out, won't we? Of course, we don't need that I got Bombarda. Revelio. Bobana. Accio. Revelio. Look for those. The foops. Foopers. I beg your pardon? This must be how the rumor about the cave started. The Foopers song is said to drive anyone who hears it mad. Accio. If the Moonstone is here and so are Foopers, I wonder if it's being protected. And now this. Accio. Bombarda. We need to find moths for those spinners. Hmm. 
The runes on the walls have something to do with finding the moths. Alright, now here comes the tricky part. It's a way across. Capture all these goddamn things. Wow. Arrest the momentum. Depulse it. Thank <laughs> you. 
water's bubbling. How odd. Should we take a closer look? You read my mind. Okay, where in the Man, hell? It's even more beautiful close up. It's got to be here. I just know it. It's a deal. I don't know. I've been listening to them for a while now, and I'm starting to lose my mind. It's very funny. I was just thinking how it's proved that potions have been here, assuming this is where the Moonstone is. Which means we're one step ahead of them. We found it! Well, we found what we came for. Right, so now we just need to bring it to the Henge. Got the stone. So now what? This did end up being the right cave after all. A good thing, too. We need every advantage over the poachers if we're to get to the Snidgets first. We should do as Doran suggested and bring the Moonstone to the Henge. Shall we? We shall. If we leave now, we should make it there by nightfall. Yeah, shall we? We sure can. Let's get the fuck out. That's the Henge, precisely where Doran said it would be. But now that we're here, I'm not in time. We knew we were at the cave for the Moonstone, but Doran didn't tell us what to expect when we placed the stone in the Henge. Whatever it is, it had better have to do with Snidgets. The clock is ticking in that regard, isn't it? Let's make our way down. We're nearly at the end of this. I think that's it over there. Moonstone inside the hinge. They really want us to climb over that. We can't just. Are they killing me with this? We can't just climb down like regular people. They want How's us to travel. How's doing, by the way? We can't Nothing just you know jump over it or fly across. Charm and threatened to make a coat out of the next poacher that set foot on her doorstep. I still feel terrible that I'm the reason they went there. Surely she'll be pleased you've gone after the Snidgets. I hope so. Gran understands how important it is to <sighs> protect those who need it. <laughs> what are you drawing on? 
That was a moon calf dance. Do you know how rare it is to see even one? They only ever happen under a full moon. Though I suppose the moonstone allowed it to happen now. Is the pattern they left behind on the ground normal? All part of the dance. No one pattern is ever the same, though. We'll need to draw this one to get a better sense of it. Can't wait to tell Gran I've managed to see not one, but two moon calf dances. She'll be jealous. You've seen this before? It was pure luck the first time. I was on high wing or I'd never have spotted it. It was the night I... Well, the night I met high wing, actually, I... I'd love to hear about how you and High Wing met. I'd actually like you to know. About five years ago, High Wing had been captured by poachers. At first, they planned to sell her, but soon decided they wanted to kill her instead. More money, I suppose. I'd finally had enough. I freed High Wing and we ran. We'd flown for ages when I spotted moon calves dancing below and we landed to watch them. It felt like an omen, a good one. A sign that the worst was over. What do you mean you'd had enough and the worst was over? You see, the night I freed High Wing was also the night I ran away from home. A poacher camp. I come from a family of poachers. Merlin? I don't know what to say, Poppy. I can't imagine what that must have been like for you. I never fitted in. But the older I got, the more apparent it became. Gran tried for years to convince my parents to let me live with her. Suffice it to say, when I left with High Wing, I flew straight for her house. How brave. I'm glad you escaped. So am I. There were so many creatures I was unable to help when I was younger. Now that's all I want to do. You can't see them all. Well, you're succeeding. I mean, hey, let's be honest, you can't save them all. Poppy, you're only one person. You can't save them all. I can try, and I've had a bit of help so far. I've never told anyone any of this, but I'm glad that you know. It's nice to have someone to talk about it with. I'm glad you told me. We should get back to Doran. He'll need to see the symbol, and we've got poachers to beat. If you collect the moonstone, I can make a quick drawing of the symbol for Doran. Are you finished with the drawing? Just barely. I think the pattern's a bird. At least that's what it looks like. Didn't the journal say the key to finding the Snidget lies in the moonlight? Of course. That's it. We need to show this to Doran. Not that I'd know where to find him at this hour. Perhaps we should head back to the castle and we can track him down after a good night's sleep. Agreed. I'm ready to leave if you are. Oh, did it get stuck? Oh, there it goes.